Hi, in today's video I'm going to show you how to download and install the new version of, or the new update I should say, for the Scan and Cut machine. Now, mine's a UK model, which is the CM600DX, but as we work our way through this process, you'll be able to look at your country and look for your model machine and see if you've got a new update as well. So first of all, I just want to say that I've actually got a USB stick plugged into my Mac. It's up here, it's called Brother. And I keep this purely and simply for updates. There's nothing else on it at the moment. And I'm gonna add this update onto it and then once I've installed the update onto my scan and cut machine, I will plug this USB stick back into my computer and delete the update. And that way, this is always an empty USB for future updates. If you don't know how to find the Brother scan and cut updates, this is my blog, a &H Crafts. So it's the address is up here, anhcrafts.wordpress.com if you're not one of my blog or YouTube followers. If you come up here to the scan and cut help and select that, that will bring you to this page. And if you scroll down, the second option along is updates. And if you click here, it will open a new window, which takes you direct to, directly to the Brother Solutions Center. From here, you choose your country and then you work your way through the process. So as I said at the beginning, I'm in the UK. I'm going to choose Europe going to come over here to United Kingdom, come to Downloads, scroll until I find the Scan and Cut machine. It says it's the CM series. I'm going to select that. I have the 600DX, so this is the one I'm going to choose. And then it says here, Search updated software 17th of December which is today you can see down here at the bottom so I'm going to click on that and then this is the most important bit you need to agree to the terms of the download and then usually there are instructions now that's just dropped into my downloads folder and I'm going to drag it out in a minute and put it on this USB stick but these are the instructions that you need to follow here. I would suggest you either try and print this off. There's a print option here. If you can't for any reason, keep this page open. And once you've got the downloaded software onto your USB stick, follow these instructions. So I'm going to come to my downloads folder, drag out my scan and cut update and drop it now onto my USB stick. And if I double click the USB stick, it's there. So that's what we need to now put onto our scan and cut machine. So I'm going to right click and eject the USB stick and that just means it, it's safe to eject it from the machine so it doesn't corrupt the program I've just put on it. And then I'm going to take it to the scan and cut machine and I'm going to follow these on screen instructions on how to install this new update and see what we've got. Okay, I quickly just want to show you that this is the version of the machine uh, that my machine is running on at the moment, 1.32. And the way I got to that was I'll go back to home, settings, scroll to the last page, and then again, and then it tells you the version. So I just wanted to clarify that before I go any further. Now, I've printed off the instructions that I showed you before. And it's number four that you want to go to. Once you've got the update onto your USB stick, here is my USB stick. And basically what I need to do is turn the machine off. So it tells me that the USB stick isn't to go into the machine at the moment and the machine needs to be off. So it's saying to me that I have to hold the load unload button 
And while I'm doing that, I have to press the power button. So I'm going to hold that and press the power and let go. And then basically you follow the on-screen instructions. So it says that I need to press, press update after connecting the USB media containing the file. So I'm going to plug this into my scan and cut. And then I'm going to press update. And it just you just have to wait now for it to do what it needs to do. So now it's saying that the upgrade is complete. According to the instructions, once it tells me that the upgrade is complete, I have to unplug the USB drive. Sorry, unplug the USB stick from the scan and cut. So there it is, taking it out. It tells me I need to turn my machine off. And then it says that I need to turn it back on again and that the software should be up, should now all be completed. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go back into the settings and have a look. And it says there now that I'm on version 1.60. So I now know that that is the correct and latest version. And then if I go into scan, I can now see that I've got this recognition icon, which I didn't have before. So I know that the update has been done because the color recognition is new in this version 1.60, which came out in the UK today which is the 17th of December so I'm going to have a play with the updates and see what it's all about and then I'll probably do a blog post and maybe a video outlining what all the new features are but that is basically how you download and install the brother software updates for your scan and cut machine I hope you found it helpful please give the video a thumbs up, please share it and subscribe if you don't already do so. Thank you.